Hey, it's Eric Dark Rider. Before the video actually gets started, just wanted to give a quick apology. Uh, during this video, the game audio didn't record. I will be fixing that up during the next episode. It OBS decided to have a bit of a knip shit for some reason. But other than that, hope you enjoy the video. Hey, it's Rick Dark Rider with Ash Twill. Yeah, it's been a while since I've done a face cam thing, but I am here doing Pokemon Emerald in a randomizer Nuzlocke. I'm on my stool. <laughs> so, yes, we know about this new game. I've always loved Pokemon Emerald because it's one of my favorite ones, and well, I've always wanted to do a randomized Nuzlocke of an older game, so I did a poll, and this is the one that won the poll. Yeah. So you got Professor Birch. Uh, huh. That's Gen 2 Lady Anne or something like that. Yeah, it's a Lady Bug. Yeah, Lady or Lady Anne, or I, f I always forget its name properly. So we live alongside with humans. Yeah, we all we all now kind of know this speech. But pretty pretty much this is, of course, going to be a randomizer Nuzlocke. I'm pretty much just going to be following three rules in the randomizer Nuzlocke. Uh, first, I'll probably name myself. I need to go around with a name. Uh, which one is it? New. That's the one. I almost clicked, ju just went in the game with the ne name of D. <laughs> I don't want to go with that. Oh, that would be funny. It would be. And I don't even know what I'm typing. There we go, there we go. Yes. So, pretty much, I'm going to be following three rules when I'm doing this Nuzlocke. So, First off, of course, if a Pokemon faints, I either release it or put it in the PC. I'll make special boxes, but like they'll be in the PC to be confirmed dead. I can't use it anymore. At the same time, uh, I'll be naming every single Pokemon, especially because I'll have a list of like names of friends. So if um, I have a friend that wanted to be in the video, I can get, like use their name for it. Um, I've been taking a list for some of my friends that want to be named after specific Pokemon stuff. But you've got that, um, if I go into an area, I'm only allowed to catch the very first Pokemon in said area, unless it's a static encounter, which, for those that don't know what that is, it's those Pokemon that literally... You have to fight. Yeah, you have no choice. I still love it, like, why the hell are you in the back of the damn truck? Yeah. You could've, you could've been crushed, you could've been brutally hurt. Or hell. Actually, no, that's not what you should... I found another question about that. It's not just the fact of why do you in the back of the truck. You notice that the only entrance and exit to this place is through that grass. Do you imagine how many Pokemon they ran over just to get that truck in here? Unless it was airdropped. And then <laughs> they Metal Gear Solid 5 ballooned it out of there. I can't believe that. <laughs> Alright, so it's 9.46pm, so I guess we'll set the night time to something correct. Uh, 9.40, 9.45, 9 and 3 quarters. So, I, I don't know why I'm having such a problem with my time. Um, uh, so, so, five, so I wanted about Give a take there. Yeah, about there. I If I'm incorrect, please let me know, but right now it says 9.47 and I put it around 9.46. If, I, if I'm wrong, just tell me in the comments, I guess. Shoot him in the foot. Don't shoot me enough. But pretty much, um, yeah, so like, none of the rules won't take effect until I, of course, get Pokeballs, so, like, if I catch, like, if I come across any... Ah. If I catch, come across any Pokemon before I actually get Pokeballs, then they don't count because, well, I can't catch anything at that point. But yeah, unless it's a Pokemon like Snorlax in the older games, but unless it's one of those Pokemon where it's um, it's, it's a forcing cat. Yeah, I don't know. 
It's more the fact that it's like, you walk into there and they're just like, Hello, who are you? Oh, you're the next door neighbor. I wish someone had a call to tell me you were coming over. And then you're just like, Ooh, Pokeball, mine. And then she doesn't like, Who are you? And then Inzy becomes friend with trying to steal something. Yeah. And like, the, the worst part is like, the mother says to go up here. And of course you look at the Pokeball on the ground, yet it's like, she makes it sound like her daughter's upstairs. And yet she wasn't. Uh, she could, and plus she says, who are you? She could have warned you that there was a guy in your room. Instant anime trope, she was gonna throw something at him. Alright, so here's where we get to see our randomized hey, starters. Look, it's a zigzag goon. Could be anything. Alright, so we got Electabuzz... Giraffe or egg? Alright. Ooh, Scyther. Mine. You'll give you a lovely, lovely little haircut. I always love Scyther. I don't know. Scyther. Yeah, in the original games, he was always my favorite. I... But funnily enough, I don't like Sizzle. I don't go wrong, it's not that he's bad, it's just like, I kind of prefer Scyther. <laughs> he's an Aussie! <laughs> he's an Aussie, Scyther! Bone ring! Oh, Whoa! Oh. <laughs> this is a Nazi. Oh, Slide is a Nazi. Oh, yeah. Oh. Did anyone put a dibs on the Aussie? <laughs> he has to be called Dundee. Nickname Dundee. No, 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 no. If I'm going for an Aussie name, I'm going for the original name. Okay. I'm not going for Dundee. And funnily enough, no. No, I know someone that's asked if I find a sizzle to name it after them, if I don't find one of their other options. But I'm naming this one. Yeah, the true Aussie. The true Aussie hero. Oh wait, I can't! It's a female! Oh, okay. New plan, we need to think of something else. Um... Oh god. How about Kate? Just simple and simple. No. We need something fast. Uh, I don't know. Yeah, I'll just go with Kate. The reason why I go Kate is because that's like a female Carl. No. Uh, yeah, don't go. Like, don't worry. The other names will be a lot more thought through than this. Just, like. I was hoping it'd be a male. Just because I would have loved to call it Steve Irwin. <sighs> that would have been good. Would have been good. I still love this Scyther. Um, so do you think you might want to be C May? Yeah, I guess. And this is the part that doesn't tell you that she's not actually in her house anymore. She effed off all the way up that way. Yeah. So let's go see. I'm going to say she might have grabbed an electron buzz. Oh well, yeah, they usually go for, like, the, the next one along. If you pick the middle one, they'll go for that one. If you pick that one, they'll go, ooh. No, it's a clever. Yeah, clever. Kill it. Yeah, bomb ring. I also have to be careful because, yeah, I can get myself a bit of a level up. Like, I know I won't get much for that. But, like, I have to be careful I don't level up too much because when I get Pokeballs, my only two moves are, like, very deadly. And I need to make sure I can catch some. There's, Fuck you, Eevee. <laughs> there's Eevees in this area. I really hope that's the first thing that's in it, I find in this area when I get to use Pokeballs, otherwise, damn. Because I actually know, like, two Eevees that I plan to name after friends. One is a Vaporeon for him. Don't worry, fat squirrels. More turtles and blastoids. Yeah. Before anything... I would rather your, uh, your, your test blastoid... Yeah, I did a test. I'll probably put it on screen now, just while I'm doing this. I made a test run to make sure the randomizer was working, and I got a Blastoise that knew, like, Solar Beam, Spike Cannon, and Air Slash. Uh, it was overpowered, for especially for a starter, and I'm like, okay, that's a good test to make sure everything's randomized, but I can't keep this. I can't pretend I didn't see this, so I reset it, and then... Now, because I knew it was working, I just reset and just kept going. Oh. Huh. That thing. You know what the ironic thing about that Pokemon is? Is Volmus technically dead? 
No, no, it, that is one of the two evolvements. It's a fact of that, um, one of the... F no. Oh, shit. I need to run. I only know ground moves and this thing's unaffected by them. But, um, Ninja. Ninja is actually one of the two fast Pokemon in game, and yet it's also one of the only Pokemon that can't learn extreme speed. Yeah. <laughs> but it's a fast one. Yeah, it's the second fastest in the entire game, and yet it can't learn extreme speed. No idea why. So, like, Ghastly able to learn the two Fire Punch and Ice Punch. Yeah. Alright, so I know I've got... I was correct. Yeah, so I know it's got a... I've kind of got a clear advantage, being that both of my moves are ground-type moves, which is what I realized when I attacked and it didn't affect Ninja, so I'm like, oh shit, both my moves don't work against you. Because <laughs> I haven't learned any new moves that are even rem That'd be good, except that's not a damaging move. Oh, we're not two levels. That's good, you went up too. Yeah, but I feel like now I'm not going to be able to catch anything. Because <laughs> I can't use Bone Rain, because that takes too much damage. So I'll have to hope that I can use Dig or something and it survives. Believe in it. That sounds the perfect idea to do. <laughs> Alright, so I'm going to go all... Like, yeah. I'm pretty much rushing through this bit, mainly because, like, I already know that I can't catch any Pokemon until I go we to... We get balls! Yeah. So technically the Nuzlocke starts the moment after I walk out of that like this lab right here because that's when I'll get the um, Pokeballs and I'll get the Dex. Which mind you, the way the randomizer set up, um, you probably would have noticed it by now, but Generations 1, 2 and 3 Pokemon are in here so I can literally come across anything at any time. I can come across starters, legendaries, like specialty Pokemon, I can come across anything in the I wild. Have a random resume. I have a Celebi. Yeah, I made a randomizer for him. He got a different starter. I think he got. Yeah, I think you got an Eevee, Lucky Ball. Yeah, I got an Eevee. Yeah, straight off the bat, an Eevee. But um, I like when it, apparently after killing so many things, he actually got lucky and caught a Celebi. Yeah, I know. I was going, yeah, it's Celebi. Uh, yeah, this is when she gives me the running shoes. Run, man, run. Run away from the problem. Yeah. And also, you did point out something else with this thing. What? The... Oh, yeah, the mother. Yeah, the mother. You only have yeah. one out room in that house. So yeah, it's, like... it, it's a thing that a lot of people caught on, like, early on, that in the original Pokemon games, the, the mother got, hasn't got a room. She sleeps on, like, the chair downstairs or something. Because Pokemon wouldn't, pro wouldn't produce, like, incest stuff now, would they? Ah, oh, actually... Oops, I should just confirm, because if I actually do have balls, I can, um... I do have balls. I, will, I hope you do. <laughs> I have balls! Alright, so let's see if we can catch our first Pokemon. What's it gonna be? Ooh! <laughs> That's a goodie! Oh, it's gonna be a gender banner one, I guess. Sure, I'll... It's a trap! Oh, I, I hope I don't kill it. I can't use Bone Brain. Bone Brain is too powerful. So let's hope Dig doesn't kill it. Let's oh, hope. I would love to see a Scyther Dig. It's gonna use like you know, like... yeah, Scyther. All right, Kate, please don't kill it, please. Just, just tap it. Just, just tap it. Oh, oh there I go. but I can't hit it anymore. <laughs> hey, hey, just, just give it a try. Just, just give it a try. I can't like. I have to hope that one of these Pokeballs actually gets it. Stay in the Pokeball, please. Stay in. One, two... Damn you! Mo use Moonlight. That heals me. That doesn't do anything. Wastes time. And it reloads the um, shakes. So it's not like constantly throwing it. You can have a break, then you throw it out again and again. That was three. Big tears. I'll try one more. I'm scared. <laughs> oh. One. No. Damn it. Fuck. I don't want to waste... Do, do I risk wasting the last one or not? Use Moonlight and we'll use one. Alright, I'll use Moonlight. Oh, 
The only thing this thing knows is mist and fake tears. Do you really want it then? No. Wait, you can like go um, have it up first, and then throw it back. So are bring we out Slither. Are kill. we gonna try it or kill it? Because we've only got two left. Yeah, we really have to, no. Like you couldn't catch anything in this area area anyway then. Yeah, but like I can always go to that top area and yeah, kill it. Slaughter it like the rest. Oh, okay, so I guess I'll just go Bone Brain. Boom. Because I already know that Bone Brain would have, like, even if it survived the first hit, Bone Brain very rarely is like a one hit and stop. It's a tour. Because what uh, goes, what oh, goes wait, around, comes around. Wait, do I have any money? Oh, I do I? Money. I think I have money left. I do! Oh, yeah, very tame. Nine Pokeballs! Yes! Oh! Happy days! That means that if um, I come across anything interesting in that top area, I might actually get to keep it. Yeah. Unless my first Pokemon I find in here is a Ninjask and then I'm screwed. <laughs> Please don't be a Ninjask. Alright, so let's try up here then. Nothing wants to appear there. There we go. Alright, what we got? Damn it! I can't hit you! Oh, damn it. I can't hit you. I'll, I'll just... I'll throw one to give me a day even ten. Because I can't attack it! I was about to say... <laughs> you caught that on the first ball. Enrage, silly slap. Uh, you sure? Wouldn't it just not do any damage? Oh, wait, it's a ghost type, isn't it? No, it, uh, it's some. I forget, like, because I tried Bone Brain and it said it had no effect, so I know it's something that can't be affected by ground type attacks. Uh, well, area two. Let's go with the friendly guy up here, just, just running through the grass. Alright, so I'm gonna see what Pokemon I can get here. This is going off to a very interesting start, and I apologize. Nine tails! Alright, sure! I'm happy with that. I like my tails. Dig it. Oh, I don't. I hope it doesn't kill it though. Take down a hole. Meteor mash. Yeah, just that's an interesting move. That's you know? a dragon. Shit! <laughs> Damn it! It's really bad because all the Pokemon are either really weak against my moves or really strong because they're unaffected. So we got plenty of time, but now I can't catch anything in this area. So that's two, three areas that now I can't catch anything in. Executor, alright. Executor. At least I know that can be affected by my bone brain. Oh, shit. Uh oh, that might be a problem. That's definitely a problem. That's a definitely a problem. At least you know Moonlight. That's not a good thing. See, I'm one. I can cheat! Because I can dig and it... Oh, wait, no. Because when it comes back, yeah, I'm dead. If, if Flame Throw is the only move it knows. Oh, yeah. You know, it's Tail Whip. What tail? It's not the lower reason. It doesn't have a tail. What happens if you lose that Nuzlocke? Well, technically it's game over. That's a short series. <laughs> yeah, it is. We just start again. <laughs> That's not the point of a Nuzlocke. I'm dead. I am so dead. No. Back. Superpower of God. Is it just tail whip on the way up? What's this gonna actually make you get just <laughs> slaughtered when it comes to it? That next flamethrower superpower, you're dead. What's worse is, like, all he needs is, like, 
If he doesn't kill me, I win! Oh, I lucked out! <laughs> that would have been a short series. Oh, thank god. Oh yeah, superpower is a fighting type move, and I'm a bug type. Well, bug flying, but still. Kill it. Kill it. Kill it. Oh, I lucked out! <laughs> Look at the fucking editor of you just then. Oh, I would have had I would have had a series over straight from the get go. <laughs> uh, I'm an idiot and I'm a new. But um, it, it doesn't help that like all of my moves are. Oh, you might want to go and re reheal and re upgrade like re upgrade. What the hell? You know what I mean? Reheal. Yeah, I'm gonna go to the Pokemon Center and heal all, like, mainly just refresh all of my moves. But the worst part is, like, if I come across anything that doesn't, like, ha like that's strong against the, um, the strong against ground type, and I, and just, like, without getting a ground type move soon, I'm dead. Yeah. Because, like, don't get wrong, I love my size though, but, like, I didn't expect that only ground type moves. Should I fight him or should I avoid him for now? Avoid him. What is that little person that's attacking him? You have to like angle down, like slither around. Wait. Oh, uh, don't don't go wrong. I will be fighting these people, but like at the current moment, new. No. Hey, you have to walk around the back behind us. Yeah. Uh... Huh. That would be cool to catch her, but I so but, but being that I have lost divorced, I have versed a nine tails in this area, I can't capture it. I think you might want to run, or you're gonna be too strong, and you kill everything. I'm, I'm I have to kill anyway. Remember, I can't catch anything in this area. I mean, run. I'm only doing it just to get that extra level up, cause fuck it. Just inches off. Cause like I'll be back to f I'll be back to fight all these people. Don't you worry. But, like, for now... Oh. Then you have to talk to the... To the... Um, I believe I have to talk to my father? Yeah. At least this one you have a father. First one you didn't hit your father is a mystery and everyone believed it was Giovanni. Yeah, normally I would, in like, in, when I... When Emerald first came out, originally I would play as the female simply for the fact of... Well, in the show, the father had a daughter. And a young, a uh, young boy is a son, but an elder daughter, not like an elder son. So I kind of kept it kind of with the show, but for this playthrough, I will be playing a guy as you saw, because well, I might as well play myself, like play Draco. So this is gonna be the tutorial thingy. Oh, I want to see if it's as beautiful as mine. I went against um a. Uh... Oh, trust me. Do, do you know what the best thing about this is? What? There is a chance that this lucky bastard has a one in a. Gold, big number chance of actually having a shiny Ralts as his opponent, but if he catches it for the rest of the game, it's not shiny. So he takes away one of your chances of being having getting shiny. Ooh, oh, up. What does he throw out? Mine was a good fire. What do you got for you throwing out? Small part. All right. Well, only <laughs> knows tackle. <laughs> wow. Is he gonna die? Oh, it still says, um, complete wave if he does die. It does? It does. Because mine was a Clefairy, like a, the first uh, involvement of uh, Clefairy. Yeah. And it was like a, um, fossil Pokemon from, oh, I think the, the second or third gen. He was going against, like, the secondary level of it. I like how he walks out as, like, in the middle. It's like, imagine if the Pokemon just attacked right now. It's like... Goldock, ah, shit! Uh, okay, so... One, two, three... Wally! I'm sure it was ball away. So, this one, do you have two? Um, you have two rivals? Yeah. Because yeah, cause technically I do, like... I, I don't think I fight him as often. I fight the other rival a lot more. But I do, I think I'll eventually, like, fight him. Head to the next city. Go fight a gym. Just try and capture a Pokemon on the way. Yeah, try to capture it. Tr capture something. Don't be a disappointment. <laughs> <laughs> At least I'm 
I'm, uh, that's what I am right now. I'm a disappointment because my Pokemon's either too strong for what I'm fighting, or it can't touch what I'm fighting. Okay, you I don't have 80. enough money. Yeah, 80. Yeah, I don't have enough money. Uh, so I guess we go into the next area. Isn't there an area down under you? No, no, that no. Or up or something? Nope, see? No, this is Pedalboard Gym. Hey, one thing, at least when you come to by Gym, you can, when you get a fishing rod, you can fish there, and it counts as a different region. I guess, yeah. Yeah, 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 because this is a different area. And then you can go back to your hometown, because there's a pond there, and you can get a crawl, and you can fish there. Ah, uh, not, the, not in this one. That, that you're thinking of Palatown. Ah. Uh, Palatown was fun. That's the area you could catch some good sheep. Alright, let's see if we can bloody catch something before this episode ends. Yeah. <gasps> Ooh! An Arbok! Alright. Chabaka. You wanna say, Miss? I can't Jessie attack her, I'll kill it! Jesse's gonna. Jesse was the only one. It was very cool. How oh. she tamed it as an Ekans punches it in the head. I think you're talking about Survivor. Oh, yeah, she punches Survivor. How did you get Ekans? It was a gift. She mentioned that in an episode. I don't remember that. Yeah, she right, now, I can attempt to attack it, but I have a hunch I'll easily kill it. So do I just do I try to use dig or do I use a pokeball? Uh, pokeball then dig. If the pokeball fails, well, we, you try dig. You try to see if we can weaken it. Please let me catch a a fucking Pokemon in the first episode at least. Dig now. Oh shit! <laughs> I'm scared! Sonic Boom. Super effective. That is the second time that it was almost a game over from the start. <laughs> Alright. Sure. I'm going back to Pokemon Center to heal. <laughs> Mommy! <laughs> Everything's dying. I'm about to kill me. I suck. I oh, severely is he, suck! Is this gonna end up like your foot? Your other one? My other one stopped because, like, they have pretty much no views. Like, for the original one. Oh, God. Oh, I apologize for any good Pokemon fans being the fact that I don't mean to suck so hard. I, I really am trying. Because everything's just either gonna die from it or gonna kill you. Uh, before I end the episode, I might as well talk to some people, tiny people in these houses actually give me stuff. Uh, okay, whatever. Mm. Okay. Sometimes these people give you stuff, sometimes they just give you information. He just talks about the water. Are they cabbages? Is this the cabbage man? Yeah, I don't think any of these guys are going to give me anything. Well, that's disappointing. <laughs> this episode didn't turn out just as I'd hoped. Hey, I have six Pokemon. That the old man said. What's this place? Great, thank you for playing with me. Uh... Oh, this is Wally's parents. Oh, second? Like, the way he was talking, though, I thought he was going to give me something. Okay, yep, so... You're trying to run all the way to the forest. So you catch something in the forest area. Well, no, there's... Uh, I'm pretty sure there's a bunch of pup trainers between me and there, so... Actually, no. Yeah, we'll, we'll try. Easy, just, there's one running on the beach, you just have to dodge. We go the beach way. Yeah. And you just don't talk to that guy. Those guys. No, only one that fights. I don't think she fights you. I'm not taking any chances. But there is that lady there who fights you, who gives you a lot of money. 
on victory. Son of a bitch! <laughs> she trolled me! I'm not going to turn. I turned! Got ya! Please don't have a dead thing. Like. Where's my other one? Oh, please don't have any moves that are gonna kill me. <laughs> Come on. Um. Erupt. Boomerang? It's a plant type. So. Okay, it's normal damage. Three times. Oh, no tackle. Okay, I'm fine with that. Tackle is something I can deal with. You can kill it. But I already know this means that, like, um, uh, I already know that, like, either the Pokemon I'm gonna find in that forest, I'm either gonna have to capture without filing or kill it. Something for the fact is that, well, I'm level 10 and both my moves do decent damage. It has to be like, able to be hit by, I'll go with this one. You have to be able to be hit by ground moves but not be killed by it. And that's a combination that I don't know if I'll get lucky with. Definitely won't be lucky no, with No, I'm gonna have to fight it. Run, 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 run. Don't, doesn't, doesn't it count? Oh wait, no. It counts. If I run, I catch nothing in the forest, so I'll miss out. I am trying. At least you have nine balls. It's really stuff I don't use them all. This is gonna be beautiful stuff. Oh, oh, oh thank toss. god I'm a spug type. Size with toss. Wait, what? Oh, it must not be a fine type move, it must be a normal. That was so Ooh. close! Oh! <laughs> the good thing is, Seismic Talk isn't. Se talk. Seismic Toss isn't doing that much damage. One, two, three. Catch! Oh, you're sticking with me! <laughs> I could survive another hit, like, unless it pulls out a flanter out of its ass, but if it had another move, it would have used it by now. Turning that thing up. Oh. Oh. Did anyone want to want to? No one. No one of a of all picks. So, um, that's a good one. What am I gonna name that one? Um. Oh, as I said, I pick friends' names. So. Oh, thing. That, that, I'm that. typing and I'm like, um, why no button work? <laughs> I'm a moron. Have to use the thing in the jiggy. Um, if I get the name wrong, I can. Oh, oh. I've also I've also had to spell the name. Shit. <laughs> um. I'll, I'll hope. I, hopefully, I'll spell this right. If I don't, I'll find the move tutor and ch um, change it. I think I spelled that right. I do deeply apologize if it's wrong. Oh, when I cap, I I finally captured a Pokemon, and now I'm going to like go back heal and get more Pokeballs. Yes, yes. So why do you grab the armor? Because I'll cut, I'll get that back, get that on my way back. So I'm going to try work my way back. I'm I'm hugging the wall because I know that yeah he, he runs around there. Yeah, I I'm pretty much hiding in his blind spots. Oh yeah, you can just hide in the blind spot. Just because I want to heal and I want to end the episode, because we are... Uh, I think 33. And at least we got a... We got fought one. After all these... Three areas. After all those dead failures, we caught a Pokemon! We are the best trainer ever. Alright, so... Let's see, let's see what we got. Whoops, I keep putting that button. 
Alright, so starting off, summary, we have Kate, ooh, and it has pressure. So that means that when my opponent uses moves, that they'll actually use their um, points faster. So that way they'll run out of their moves faster. Right, decent stats, yeah. Two, <laughs> two ground moves and a healing move, that's, that's great. So, you got that. Hey, Rupix has something. What do you have? Zinc. Zinc. Oh, I can sell that! That actually comes for a decent price, I believe. Static. Pr <laughs> it's a fire Pokemon that knows static as its ability. So that means that anything that does a physical attack against Vulpix is paralyzed on contact. And it. Ooh! It did know another move! Horn attack. Okay. I'm surprised though, because, like, I'm a bug flying, and I believe the fighting moves aren't supposed to do much damage against me, yet Seismic Talks do normal damage against me. So I don't know if I was misreading it or whatever, but yeah. But Horn Attack is good, even though I don't know where Vulpix is, like, maybe under that, like, b like little hair bun, maybe there's actually just, it's got, like, two evil devil horns. I was about to say something, but it's a girl. Yeah, I know, that's why I made that exact comparison to horns, because I knew how dirty you'd take it. May? Yes, you. May? Yes, him. Never. Alright, I'm gonna... Nope, 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 nope. Sell, and then I'm gonna end the episode. Uh... Where is it? There it is. Zinc. See? That's a good amount. Yeah, Zinc's like all those other ones where you're self right. I never went really to the competitive, so I never, like... Bought, I never used or any of them, the Zinc and all that. But I did sell them for because they were always great for a price. I'm looking, getting balls now. Uh, yeah. Should I get that many balls and get the rest in potions? Uh, probably get 20 balls and the rest in potion. Well, I'll say 25 because that gives me an even 30. Yeah, why not? And, oh yeah, and I forgot, if you buy 20 more balls, he um, gives you a premier ball, so now I've got 20, I've got 31. So, premier balls are not even that good. It's, well, to be fair, would you, like, don't look at it, the fact that it's not that good, like, it's similar to, like, a normal Pokeball, just a tiny bit better, but think of it this way, it's an extra Pokeball. Yeah, yeah, yeah. look at this guy. Oh, you got 20 balls. Here's one ball free. It's white, too. <laughs> I keep it in my special stash. Alright, so, that's a, that was a hair-raising start to the randomizer. Well, he ended. Nearly ended. Twice! Not once, not twice. And, he, and it wasn't even against the rival, it was against trainers! Like... One was in a trainer. Yeah, one was Yeah, trainer. one was in a trainer with an Exeggutor, which was the first trainer I fought. And one was with a, with a Arbok. Yeah. So, next episode, um... We have to get through that forest without dying. Yeah. Um. Well, actually, I'll, uh, now that I have another Pokemon, I probably will. But like, what I'll, what I'm thinking about doing is the Volpix. I'm probably gonna take it into that area and level it up a bit. Not too much, so that way I have a Pokemon to capture Pokemon with. But more enough so it doesn't die. Yeah. Because I want to make sure that. But I'm gonna, because I'm gonna. This is where I'm gonna start leveling up Scyther a lot to make sure it learns other moves. Cause goddamn. With ground attacks, man. Ground attacks. <laughs> yes, that's not... What happens when I fight a flying type? I'm fucked. Or, um... Ghost type? Die. Yeah, are they weak again? I've, I've forgotten what types don't I know, care normal, about ground. normal types don't work on ghost types. Yeah. Well, you should be good if you fight electric. Yeah, if I fight electric, yeah. Which is ironic that the, the, the one my opponent picked was an electrical type. So, that was ironic. But anyway, hope you enjoyed the video so far. Um, if you like this video, make sure to hit the like notif- like the- hit the like down below. Make sure you hit the bell notification icon down below, so that way you're notified by every time we post a video. And also, with this, like, the area just before here, you saw all those trainers. Before I actually go continuing with the route, did you guys want me to, in the next episode, actually spend some time and fight those trainers in, like for your entertainment on camera or fight them off camera so that way next time in, in next episode when I continue 
well, I just keep going. I don't have to go back and fight the trainers. That's up to you guys. I'm going to leave that choice up to you. But for now, we hope you enjoyed the video so far, my friends. Uh, leave a like, leave a subscribe, check out the videos, and we shall see you in the next video. Thank, Thank you, you and, and goodbye. goodbye.